guys welcome back to my channel in today's video I'm going to be doing a plan with me in my Erin Condren planner and I'm gonna show you a few new releases from our shop shine sticker studio on Etsy before I get started so let's see we have some daily asset well the, we call these our daily essentials because they're things that you can use in your planner daily, weekly, whatever. They're functional stickers. So um, we have some small sheets and these are some kawaii cameras. Um, they come in two different styles. You can get just the plain rainbow or glitter. And then these other sets um, don't come in glitter but they have little bows on them which I think is just as cute so we've got some little pills to help you remember when to take medication or administer medication to a loved one or your pet or something um, we have some cute little smartphones I love these um, and then some laptops Okay, and then we also have these new Bill Do box stickers, and these fit perfectly, like widthwise, inside of the Erin Condren or Happy Planner boxes. They're one and a half inches wide, and we've got a bunch of different colors here, so they can go with any spread that you might have in your planner. And now I'm going to show you the two new kits that we came out with. Um, let's see, I'll show you this one first. This is the kit that I'm going to be using in today's video. And this is called our Candy Color Pop Kit. I love the colors. I love this little deco sticker. Sweet as candy. Okay, here's the full boxes. Um, checklists. And we do have one, like, weekly tracker box. I'm not sure what that's supposed to be called, but I use it for meal planning, so I hope that's useful for other people as well. Um, then we have the half boxes and quarter boxes and the washi strips. If you get the regular kit, it only comes with these three sheets, but if you get the deluxe, it comes with these three plus the washi and the half boxes, which are perfect for um, achieving like a no white space spread. And most of our kits actually um, have that option. Okay, so I don't have um, our Easter kit printed and cut because I <laughs> actually put it in my planner so I don't have a set that's ready to go. But I'll just show you what it looks like if you were to lay it out in your planner like this. Um, and my printer prints very um, lightly so this looks very pastel and I love it so much so cute and I wanted to show you um, what all I had left so I still had a few like flags and uh, headers, some half boxes, quarter boxes, and some washi strips. So even if you use the deluxe kit for a no white space spread, you'll still end up usually having stickers left over, which is awesome. I wanted to show you this. I was really proud of this one. Follow the bunny, he has the chocolate. I think that's just so cute. So anyway, those are some new releases, and I'm going to go ahead and get started with my plan with me. I'm going to start by putting down the date covers. This is what I usually do, and because of the angle, I'm going to actually do this upside down because it's just easier for me. By the way, the um, stickers that I'm using are in our weatherproof paper format, which is new to our shop, and we didn't really announce it, so I don't think a lot of people know about it, but you have the option of getting either our regular um, repositionable matte sticker paper 
or the new weatherproof and that's what I'm using here and I love it it's it's the paper is like super smooth and it feels like butter when you write on it and it also prints a lot nicer so like the images are clearer and um, there the stickers are also thinner so it adds less bulk to your planner but the paper is denser if that makes sense like it is thinner but um, it's a lot less uh, translucent so like I don't know if you can see but these date covers have a lot of white in them but it's still covering up the black text underneath because the sticker paper is just really good <laughs> So I don't think that I'm going to do a no white space spread. I mean, I like the way they look, but I just, I, I kind of like having the white space in there sometimes. So I think that's what I'm going to go for. Okay, so I do know that I want this quote sticker. I usually put the one that has like text on it up here so even though these stickers are weatherproof and the adhesive is a little bit more aggressive you still can peel it up you just got to be careful and it will it might um, do a little bit of damage to the paper but I mean if you're gonna cover it up anyway that bothers me. Should I move? I don't know what to do. I'm gonna put it underneath this, underneath these dots. So, so it'll cover up that little green flag. Okay. It takes like 10 years to put one sticker down. Oh my goodness. Okay. So instead of doing like my to-dos all the way across the top like I usually do when I'm doing a no white space spread, I think I'm gonna kind of switch things up and be a little bit more random. What I usually do with the full boxes is I put them underneath a today header. And these are really good for that because they're just patterns. So if I need to write something on top that's happening for the day, I can do that or I can layer stickers on top of it. Oh, hello. We do have TV stickers in our shop, but I can't find mine, so I'm just going to use these from Lemon Paper Co. and they're really cute, so I don't mind using them. So I'm just going to layer that on top like that, and then I'm going to write The Walking Dead. are our grocery bag stickers. I really like to use the 
this pen in my Hobonichi. It's the Famer Castell Pit Artist pen in extra small. So the tip is really, really tiny. I don't know if you can see that, but um, because I use it like on top of watercolor, it's starting to like skip a little bit. So I think I'm not gonna use this anymore. I'll try using this crown pen. So I don't really have any other to-dos on Tuesday. So I'm just going to grab one of these stickers. This is a sheet from a booklet that I got at the Target Dollar Spot last summer. The colors really match well, so I'm just gonna see if that'll just fit right in there. Look how cute. I'm gonna grab another quarter box and I'm just going to layer it right here on top. I could write directly on top of that, but I feel like this helps me see it a little bit better. And I'm just going to write game day because there is going to be a little peewee game at the school that I work at. Okay. And you can use whatever type of pen you want on top of the mat. Uh, weatherproof uh, but if it is like a gel ink or like a fountain pen um, you might want to give it a second before you just start rubbing all over it because it takes a moment to dry let me see if that's dry yet yeah so that dried and this is gel I think or a fountain pen I don't know Tuesday is trash day. Okay, I need to pull this down then. I found these other TV stickers. These are from Stick With Me Shop. These are the trash can stickers from our shop. Um, I guess I'll do blue. Why not? I'm gonna put it right here. Look at all the kawaii cuteness. Of our new laptop stickers. I'm so excited to use it. <laughs> These are just so cute. Where do I want to put it? Maybe like that. And I'm gonna grab one of our shopping bag stickers. got these uh, emoji stickers from the Target Dollar Spot during the Valentine's Day. <laughs> Valentine's Day. Okay, from the Valentine's Day collection. <laughs> that was funny. I'm gonna use this one because that face, that face is how I feel about doing the training videos that I have to do. This sheet is also from Lemon Paper Co. and it has this little sticker that says my goals and I think I'll just put that right there because it is definitely one of my goals for Friday. I'm gonna use one of these, one of our new camera stickers. Maybe I'll just use pink. And then I think because I have room for it, I'm gonna put the little deco sticker that says sweet as candy. Ooh. Right here. Because I mean, how cute is that? 
I'm going to grab the weekend banner and I'm going to put it right here. I think I'll use a glitter one this time just to switch it up. And I'm going to grab one of our kawaii smartphones. Maybe I'll use yellow. I'm going to put it right there. And I'm going to put post on Instagram to remind myself. Okay. Let's, ooh, you know what? I need to put the washi down at the bottom. So now I'm going to do my sidebar. I like to put this flag up here. Okay, then I'm going to put this down. So I'm going to use one of our kawaii clipboards on my sidebar because I think they're just adorable and like I feel like I have to use it <laughs> in my spread. Um, but also because it helps me see like the really important things that I need to do this week. Okay, these stickers are from Planning in Mint. They're really pretty, I love the colors. And the blue actually matches perfectly. Oh my goodness, I cannot spell training. I put train G. Oh well, <laughs> whatever. I'm gonna use a quarter box right here. Tracker, you know what? I'm gonna run out of my run out of room. I might be able to use this hydration sticker. Would I have room for it plus this? Not really. So I'm gonna have to do some rearranging so that I can fit everything that I want to fit. Awesome. So I can still plan out my meals and down here I'm gonna put hydrate. Okay, so that is the completed spread. However, I could put something there. So I think I'll just grab a washi strip. I think I might put one right there too. Okay, so now I'm just gonna add some accessories to go with my spread. This confetti tassel is from Elite Planners Club and it goes perfectly with this. And I also am going to put on this adorable glitter nerdy cat clip from Planning in Mint. I love it so much. And also this emoji clip. This is just a little felt uh, sticker thing that I got at, in a pack at the Target Dollar Spot. Okay guys, so that completes this spread for the week. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please comment, like, subscribe, whatever you wanna do to support me, I will appreciate it. And I will see you guys in my next video. Okay, thanks, bye.